Intel just sent me their Helios 300 gaming laptop with a 10th generation Core i7 processor. Let's see what this bad boy can do. We are playing some PUBG. And as always, when in PUBG or any game in general, you need to make sure you look awesome. So that's why we're sporting the custom Sacriel hoodie. So we're in a lobby. We're going to play some squads with random people from the internet. So we've got into four man squads, um, but with randoms. What I call a lucky dip, because you never really know what kind of players you're going to end up with. Sometimes they're super aggressive. Sometimes they're really stealthy and sneaky. Uh, it's kind of a fun way to play. Oh, here we go. Wish me, wish me luck. Wish me luck. The magazine will go on my gun. So we've got an extended mag now or a quick reload mag. Smoke grenade is really useful. Extended, a hey, nice. That's a better magazine for us there. Extended quick draw mag. Ooh, frying pan. Classic, classic PUBG weapon. The frying pan actually stops bullets. So by equipping it on your back, you can actually have a little bit of protection. The sight lines in PUBG always blew me away. I love how much of the map you can see. One of the awesome things about being on the new Intel Core i7 10750H is that it can stream, record and game up to 45% faster than something like a Intel Core i7 7700HQ. So we are getting some beautiful frames right now. And not only is this a beautiful monitor, it's also 144 hertz, which blows 60 hertz out of the water. And it has a three millisecond overdrive response time, so your frames keep crystal clear during those high octane moments. I'm a big fan of the, uh, the vaulting and stuff they've added to the game. Kind of, the hours can be a bit rigid, especially kind of mill sim realistic -y style ones. Uh, but adding a little bit of parkour just freshens up even a even an existing map that you've played hundreds of times before. Once they added the uh, the leaping system and the the vaulting system, it just kind of opened the map up even more. Twenty eight people left. There's only three of our team, and we're pretty low on resources at the moment. Why, are you, Jeffrey? Why? No, please, no, don't drive into the smoke, please, don't drive into. The smoke. I don't. <laughs> Jeff's got this. Jeff's got this. Jeff don't got this. Alas, like most PUBG rounds for me, it ends with me crawling on my hands and knees outside the blue. As Jeffrey dies, crawling on his hands and knees outside the blue. <laughs> well, that concludes our little stint of PUBG. I hope you enjoyed the video. Thank you very much for watching and I'll see you in the next one.